This is not financial advice. This is not legal advice. This is for ent entertainment and education for purposes only. And everything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decisions based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff. So you get the videos that put them out. See what I'm thinking. See how I'm analyzing the data. And a lot of you are not going to agree with the way I analyze the data. As we know from the last 48 hours, all the ripping I got for my last video. But that's neither here nor there. Y'all ripping me on Twitter, on YouTube, is not going to change the way I analyze the data. But a lot of times, the shills, and sometimes even the apes, they, co they complain that I complain too much. They complain that I call out the bad actors every day. And what they fail to realize when they tell me that I'm not calling out the same things every day. The thing is, they do so much malfeasance, so much shenanigans that every day is something new. Every day is a new crime or every day is a new company committing a new crime. And before I went to law school, I was in law enforcement. And at one point I was actually an officer in the courts and when somebody commits a crime and they're arrested they come before the judge and maybe they're released on their own recognizance maybe they're released on bail but when that happens good morning when, when that happens and they are released if they commit a new crime we need to arrest them again we and if it's a felony we need to put it before a grand jury again we need to get them indicted again so when they commit new crimes we don't lump it all together and say oh well he did this before he did this before so we're not going to arrest him for this because he's done it 20 times in the past no every single crime is a different act it's a different criminal complaint so the fact that it seems to a lot of people that I'm complaining about the same thing every day, I'm not, I'm not complaining about the same thing every day. What it is, is they do so much criminal activity. They commit so much, so many felonies. They do so many things that's in violation of US monopoly laws, US antitrust laws, SEC rules and regulations that I have no choice but to to call them out. They'll they'll do one thing today and then tomorrow more evidence will come out of further corruption, further malfeasance, further shenanigans. And the SEC knows what's going on because we are not professional SEC investigators. I mean, I'm certified in financial crimes investigations. Okay, I am certified in financial crime investigation, but I wasn't aware of all the corruption and malfeasance that's being allowed to go on on Gary Gensler's watch. And from everything I've seen in the last two years, this has been going on since prior to Gary Gensler. This has been going on since prior to Gary Gensler. They are allowed to rob retail investors and every day is something different. So when you guys think that I'm complaining about the same things every day, I'm not. The thing is that every day, there's just so much new violations of the law. Every day, the more I read, the more I dig, the more DD that I do. All I see, good morning, man. All I see is more malfeasance, more corruption, more criminal activity. And then all they do is pay a small fine. And it's not even really a fine. All they do is give a cut to the government and it's business as usual. It's business as usual. Anyway, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff, and tell me what you think about all the different criminal activity that's going on every day. And remember, I'm not complaining about the same thing every day. It's just new 
criminal acts that they're doing every single day. Anyway, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff. I appreciate y'all on this journey with me. God bless.